Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're going to go over options for smart switches that don't require a neutral wire. And why is that important? Well, if you've got a house built after 1980, you most likely have a neutral wire in your switch box, which means that you're going to be compatible with most every brand of smart switch out there. However, if you have an older home built before 1980, there's a good chance that you don't have a neutral wire in your switch box, which is required for most smart switches. Or maybe you just live in an area of the country where code didn't require a neutral wire in your switch boxes. In that case, you're not going to be able to use every different type of smart switch. There are only a few smart switches that will work in instances where you don't have a neutral wire in your switch box. And if you want to learn more about what a neutral wire is or how to identify a neutral wire or if you have one in your house and in your switch boxes, we've got multiple videos that address that. So check that out down below in the description in the links to those videos that will go through exactly what a neutral wire is, why it's important, and how to find out if you have one. However, if you've already done that and determined that you don't have a neutral wire in your switch box, one option is that you can run a new neutral wire to your switch box so that you can use whatever smart switch you want. Now, there's a lot of downsides to this because you're going to have costs for wire, and most often you're going to need to open up drywall to run the new wiring, and it can be a big headache to get that extra wire in there and the associated cost with getting that extra neutral wire in the actual switch box. But don't worry if you want smart lighting and smart switches, there is a solution that doesn't require a neutral wire in the switch box. And that's what we've got here today. They primarily revolve around the Lutron Cassetta system, which we've got here, and the Leviton Decora smart switches, which we've got right here. Now, there are a few other smart devices that will work without a neutral wire in the switch box. However, in my experience, these two have been the most reliable in my testing over years and years, and they have worked for me, and I have not had issues with either one of these. They've been very reliable and easy to set up. Now, the Lutron Cassetta system has two styles of switches and dimmers that are now available. They have the traditional style Lutron Cassetta dimmer, which you can see right here, and they also have their newer Lutron Diva dimmer switch, which I just did a video on a couple weeks ago, which is an update from the design and many people might find more appealing than their traditional light switch dimmers. Now, the Lutron Cassetta system doesn't require a neutral wire for installation, and we've got videos that show you how to install the system and how to set it up. So check that out in the description below. But the Lutron Cassetta smart switches do require the Lutron Cassetta smart hub in order to connect to these Lutron Cassetta switches and allow you to control them remotely. Once you set up that smart hub, you're going to be able to control them from your phone, but you're also going to be able to control them using voice assistants and voice commands if you have a compatible voice assistant like ALEXA, a Google Home, or Siri, which is great because you have dual functionality with voice control or control from your phone. And you can also set up schedules or scenes to remotely control these ahead of time, as well as control them when you're outside your home or within your home. Now, the Leviton smart dimmers that don't require neutral work in a very similar way. You wire up the Leviton smart dimmer that doesn't require a neutral wire, and then it connects to these modules right here, which allow you to remotely control them from your phone and or with voice assistance, and they also work with ALEXA, Google Home, and Siri voice commands. Now, what I like about these are they are very inconspicuous, and they just connect directly to your Wi-Fi, whereas with the Lutron Cassetta system, you do need to wire that hub directly into your Wi-Fi router, whereas these will connect to your Wi-Fi router and you can place them anywhere in your home. I only needed one or two of these in order to get it working in my house and control all of my Leviton smart switches. You may only need one. Now, the Leviton smart dimmers, they do have scheduling and they also have scenes just like the Lutron Cassetta system. 
In fact, both of these systems are very similar except for how they connect to their hubs and how they connect to the internet. You've got the smaller device here for the Leviton switches and you've got the larger hub style device for the Lutron Cassetta system. And they both work with smart voice assistants which allow you to control them with your voice as well as you can control both of these remotely or control them with schedules and different scenes. So if you're in the market for a smart dimmer switch or a smart switch that doesn't require a neutral wire, either one of these are good, reliable options that will work with all the different voice assistants out there on the market. Now, we've also got videos that show you how to install the Leviton smart dimmers that don't require neutral wire, as well as the smart dimmer installation videos for the Lutron Cassetta system. So I recommend you take a look at all of those videos below if you want to learn more about either one of these or you want to learn specifically more about the reviews that we've done on each one of these where we have an individual video for each style of switch. But you can see here we've got a couple different styles. Here we've got the Lutron Cassetta switch and this is the look of that smart switch that doesn't require neutral wire. Now we've also got the Lutron Diva smart dimmer that doesn't require a neutral wire right here and this just came out in late 2022. And the last one we've got here is the Leviton smart dimmer that doesn't require a neutral wire. And you can see the style of switch here, as well as Leviton makes a smart switch that doesn't require a neutral wire. And that just is missing that toggle on the side that allows you to dim the switch, but it operates the same and works on the same app. So both of these have their own apps that they work on and the apps are actually very similar. The Leviton app works great and the Lutron app works great as well in my testing. So thank you for watching this video on options for smart switches that don't require a neutral wire. If you like this video, please give us that thumbs up, subscribe, or click any of the links below if you wanna support us. Thank you.